You know, it's, it's blackmail, isn't it? I mean, I think that uh, what we've got here is a Congress, a U.S. Congress, that is really literally controlled um, by the various Zionist lobbies in, in the United States on, on the issue of relationships with Israel. Um, so essentially what the Congress does in terms of Israel is what the Zionists tell them they want done. And of course the Zionists take their, um, their cue from the Israelis. Now, <clears throat> and the Congress essentially controls the budget in the United States. So they have the power to cut off um, the, the Palestinian Authority. Now the question, why should the Israelis be uptight about this, or why should they object, um, is an interesting one. Um, I, my personal view is that <clears throat> It's, it's almost psychological. What the Palestinians are going to do in September is almost a replication, almost a repeat of what the, uh, what the Zionists did in 1947-48 to get um, a, a, uh, an Israeli state. Right? They go to the UN and they have the UN General Assembly vote to uh, recognize um, uh, an uh, Israeli state. Now the Palestinians are actually following the same path. And I think this is <clears throat> psychologically you know, a, a traumatic for the Israelis because they won't be able to say, oh, well, the Palestinians aren't a people, aren't a state, I mean, because they've been recognized the same way Israel was recognized, uh, which really uh, would, is going to make things psychologically, very, very difficult for the Israelis. To deny the Palestinian statehood is essentially to deny the process that created the Israeli statehood. So I think, you know, I think that that is what's going on here. Because in terms of practicalities, um, it means nothing. I mean, the Israelis will continue to do what they do, continue to steal the land, make the settlements, there's, you know, there's nothing else that's going to change on the ground. Um, so you know, the question is, again, why should they be upset? And the only answer I can come up with is, you know, it, it messes with their, their collective national head, to use an American phrase.